Hello, my dear students. Today we will talk about quadratiles. First of all, we need to know that the quadratile is closed figure with four sides and four angles. Quadratiles are named based on their sides and angles. The diagram show how quadratiles are related. So let's look. So let's look carefully here. The quadratile we have. We have trapezoid and trapezoid has only two opposite side or parallel. Only that, okay? And we have the parallelogram. And you should know that in the parallelogram, each two opposite sides are parallel and equal in length. And we have rectangle. And you should know that the rectangle has four angles, right angle. And each opposite side are equal in length. And we have course square, and square has four sides are equal in length and four right angle. We have rhombus. The rhombus has four sides equal in length, but it 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 has no right angle. So the difference between rhombus and square that the square has four right angle okay this information is so important and we will use it a lot okay and so i need for you to save it the sum of measure of the angles of a collateral is 360 so for any collateral the sum of the four angles equal 360 degree okay don't forget you need to save it right don't forget that I told you that you need to save it. Okay. Now, Habibi, I want for me to open your booklet page 81. Let's see the first example we have here. Here, you want for me to classify the equilateral using the name. So, you will tell me what's the name of each one of that. What about number one? Can you tell me what's the name of number one here? Yeah, super. I can hear you. That's cool. that's parallelogram, right? What about the second one? It showed to us that each two opposite sides are equal in length and the four angles right angles. So, what is the name of this figure? Yeah, super. That's rectangle. And let's see number 3. If you look carefully, you will see that the four sides are equal in length and the four angles right angles. So that's what <clears throat> super that's square. Let's continue. Now I need from you to stop the video, try to solve seven and eight alone, then play the video again, compare in between your answer and mine. But before you compare, I'm sure of that your answer will be correct because you're super okay guys now stop the video and I'm waiting for you welcome back Habibi so let's see your answers so number seven can you tell me what's the name of number seven yeah super I'm sure your answer is correct it's the parallelogram what about number eight yeah that's rhombus now let's see this question. He want for me to find the missing angle measure of each quadratile. So here he gave you the measure of four, of three angles, and he want for me to find the fours. So we need that the sum of uh, of measure of all angles are equal three hundred sixty degree. So if I want to find the measure of angle X. All what I have just make 360 degree minus the three angle that we have here, okay? So that will be 360 degree minus 52 degree plus 90 degree plus 90 degree. So first of all, can you tell me 90 degree plus 90 degree plus 52 degree equal what? Come 
Roman, I'm waiting your answer. Yeah, I can hear you. Super, that will be 232. So, now all what you have, just make 300 KC minus 232. And that will give you 128, okay? So the measure of angle X here is 128. Let's continue. What about the value of measure of uh, what about the value of angle X here? So the measure of angle X here will equal what? Like we said before, our rule tells us that the sum of the four angles equal 360 degrees. So we will make 360 degree minus the sum of the three angles that he already gave it to you. So that will be 75 degree plus 110 degree plus 135, right? So, can you tell me 75 plus 110 plus 135 equal what? Come on, I'm waiting for you. Take your time, there is no need to rush. Super, that will be 320. So, 360 degree minus 320 equal what, Habibi? That will equal 40 degree. Excellent. And now, Habibi, we finish our lesson. I hope you understand the lesson. So, bye and see you next time, inshallah. Bye.